by Harriet. Okay, I need your help again. Okay. Okay, can you dance? I can do it! Right, perfect. Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. First we'll clap our hands just so. Clap, 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 clap. Then we'll bend and touch our toes. Oh. Ooh. Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. Good Woo. job! You too, Harriet. So, guess what our word, is, our letter is today? Oh, uh, oh, I see it, I see it. It's D. It's a D. Guess what starts with the letter D. Oh, well, I see <coughs> dog. Also, dump truck. Mm -hmm. And dreams. That's right. Yep. And down. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, hey, do, do you have an early literacy tip for us Oh, today? my goodness, I do, I okay. do. It's print concepts. You know what that means? No. Well, it really just means that knowing print has meaning. Yeah. Oh. So we know that this is a dog. Yeah. Because, well, because we can read. But yeah. also, also, because there's a picture of a dog. Yeah, of mm -hmm. course. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, today, Stephanie and Whitney are going to read a story yeah. about a little crab and a very big crab! Oh, I'm so excited to hear Are you excited? Me too. Mm -hmm. Let's get to it. Okay. Don't Worry Little Crab, written and illustrated by Chris Houghton, published by Candlewick Press. Little Crab and Very Big Crab lived in a tiny tide pool. Today, they're off to the ocean. This is gonna be so great, says Little Crab. They go tick a tick, tick a tick over the rocks, splish splash, splish splash across the pools, and squelch, squelch, squelch through the slimy, slippery seaweed. I can't go anywhere, says Little Crab. Finally, they get to the very edge. Here we are, says Very Big Crab. The ocean! Oh, says Little Crab. Maybe it's better if we don't go in the ocean, says Little Crab. Don't worry, says Very Big Crab. It will be okay. But the waves are getting bigger. <gasps> Look, a huge wave. Hold tight. Here it comes. <gasps> Whoosh. Uh, I think I've had enough ocean for now, says Little Crab. Let's just go a little bit farther, says Very Big Crab. I think you'll like it. But the waves keep getting bigger and bigger. <gasps> Another one. Hold tight. Here it comes. Whoosh. I like the ocean, says Little Crab. Maybe we should go home. Don't worry, Little Crab, says Very Big Crab. I'm here. Come, just a few more steps. Little Crab takes a step, then another, until... I'm in the ocean, says Little Crab. <gasps> But then they see an enormous wave. It gets bigger and bigger. Ready? Asks Very Big Crab. Little Crab nods. They take a deep breath. <gasps> Here it comes. Whoosh! Down 
down, down they go. Look, little crab. Everyone comes to say hello. My name is Little Crab, says Little Crab. They eat delicious seaweed. They run all across the sea floor. They have a giant game of hide and seek. I love the ocean, says Little Crab. Yes, but it's time to go home now, says Very Big Crab. What? I don't really want to go home, says Little Crab. Well, how about we go the long way home, says Very Big Crab. We go up this way, <gasps> says Little Crab. I think you can go anywhere, says Very Big Crab. And off they went. The, the end. end. Hey guys, welcome back. That was a great story about a little crab and a very big crab. And where did they live? The ocean. That's right. And this is kind of like the ocean, but we're going to call it the deep blue sea. Here in the middle is the deep blue sea. There was a red rock in the middle of the deep blue sea. On that red rock was a green tree on the red rock in the middle of the deep blue sea. Here it is. On that green tree was a brown coconut. There's a brown coconut on a green tree on a red rock in the middle of the deep blue sea. A parrot flew in. She was a purple parrot and she landed on that brown coconut on the green tree on the red rock in the middle of the deep blue sea. A butterfly flew in and she landed on a parrot. She was an orange butterfly on a purple parrot on a brown coconut on a green tree on a red rock in the middle of a deep blue sea. Then the yellow sun came out and it shone on everybody and a little white cloud floated by. Pretty soon though that white cloud turned gray and it started to rain. And what happens when it rains and the sun shines out? Out comes a rainbow! And the rainbow shines on the orange butterfly, on the purple parrot, on the brown coconut, on the green tree, on the red rock in the middle of the deep blue sea. The end. Okay, that is all for a story time. Mm -hmm. You ready to sing a goodbye song? I'm ready. Okay. See you later, alligator, after a while, crocodile, give a hug, ladybug, blow a kiss, jellyfish, see you soon, big baboon, out the door, dinosaur, take care, polar bear, wave goodbye, butterfly. Alright guys, thanks, we'll see you later.